Namaskar, Amar Bondura. Aj Amra Kenekata Korte Jachi. Ami Magis Noodles Kinbo. And I've never had them before, so let's check it out. Ami Noodler Kache. Ami Noodle Dekchi. Kintu Magi Noodles Kothai. Ooh, yes! So I wasn't able to get any masala. What I did get, this, this, and this. So I found more Maggi, another section. So they've got the masala here. So I'm thinking maybe if I put back the big massive family packs and just get a few of these. They don't have the beef. Maybe I'll keep the beef. You can also see that they do some other products. Ami Kinbo, Tuto Murge Mangsho, Tuto Masala, Tuto Curry, Hatch, uh, barbecue guru mind shop. I'm not gonna get his face in, but someone is a big Maggie fan. Akun Ami Bari Teachi, Amar Nudeler Shonge, Rana Kore, Tumi Dekte Paro, Ami Egulo Rana Korbo, Kintu Rana Korte Janina, Ami If I to the noodles, um, ami, ami jol dai, is that rana kora? I don't know. Ami amar uchoron karap jani akintu ami cheshta korchi komo koro. Some of them want you to stir and simmer in a pot, and I only have two small pots, so um, I think what I'm gonna do is use the kettle method for the barbecue. It says that you can just pour water in and cover. So we'll do that in a bowl. And then with the other three, I will fry in pots. And actually I might, I might even use a frying pan to do one. So let's get to it. The kettle's boiling. And I just broke open one of the packets for the first time. I like the smell of these. I think they smell nice, so. That's a good sign. It's raining barbecue beef flavor. So they are all going now. We've got the chicken. We've got our masala one here. The curry one. And last but not least, the beef, which is just in there. What I've done, because I feel like the beef one was getting the raw end of the deal, is the chicken was done. And I'm giving this a quick simmer to kind of reduce it down a bit. So here we are, it's finally time to taste the noodles. And Ami Ekane, Amar Jol Ache. Let's have a go with the curry one. No, the chicken one. Basically, no smell. It's very plain looking. Let's give it a go. It's good. It's okay. It's quite bland. If I were making this again, I would probably add half a chicken stock cube or something like that to it. A bit of pepper. Doesn't need any more salt. It's very soft. So I didn't really follow the instructions perfectly because I don't like a very soupy bowl of noodles. So that means that they're a bit like, like they've absorbed most of the flavor in the soup. It's just not very chickeny. It's just very weak. And it doesn't, it doesn't taste meaty at all. Okay, let's put that to the side and let's move on to the barbecue beef. New four. It, do, it has a barbecue smell, but it does smell a bit like fake. It does have a bit more color to it than the chicken. There's more flavor in the smell than in the food. That's a bad thing, by the way. Bit of a disappointment. I had higher hopes for the barbecue. It's very bland. What would I even do to this? I don't even know. How do you make, how do you make a barbecue flavored thing more barbecue? It's just got this lingering barbecue, like taste or smell that's all up in me, but it's not really that nice and it's just bland. So I have high hopes for this one, the curry. It looks very 
orange. I don't know what the bangla is for orange, but it looks very orange. It definitely smells like curry, which is good, but it doesn't smell great. Let's see what it tastes like. Mmm, that's good. Oh, slightly chow, bit of a kick. These are good. So far, number one is definitely the curry. They're also not like under seasoned. You know what, you could tell, see whenever you open the packet and you take the sachet out, it's by far the heaviest of the four. So I had a feeling that it would be nice, it would be flavorful. Yeah, the smell doesn't do the taste justice. Like it's actually really nice. So yeah, definitely out of the three so far, the curry is definitely the nicest. They're actually really good. I could see me buying those in the future. These, if you're in a pinch, would probably be the easiest because you don't need to add anything. You just chuck it in the, in the saucepan, simmer it, and away you go. And last but not least, we've got the masala, which I think is the one everyone talks about. It has a kind of weak masala smell but i'm hoping that the flavor is a lot stronger than it smells you know what it's nice it's a it's really nice a nice flavor but it's very very weak you can tell that the flavor is really nice but they just don't give you any of it there's just not enough oh, it's such a shame because it's really nice but you can barely taste it. It's like they're keeping it a secret. If I had to order them, the worst for me is probably the beef. It's just not really that nice of a flavor and that's about it really. Then the next least like, so in third place, I would give it to the chicken. The chicken's all right, but again, like the masala, they just don't give you enough of the flavoring in the sachet. Like it's. It's too bland. And then in third place, I have to put the masala because again, the flavor is really nice, but they just don't give you any. It's just not strong enough. And the winner, by far, I actually think, I think that these are by far the best. The curry, the flavor is really good. Mm. By far, it's got so much more flavor than all of these. The flavor of this curry is really, really good. You know what? I'm having dinner in like an hour or two, so I can't actually really eat much, but I really want to finish these. These are really good. So that means I don't get to enjoy a full Maggie, not today, but I do have this packet and the shop's only around the corner. So in the future, I can get more of this, no problem. If you want to see more videos like this in the future, please hit subscribe and thanks for watching the video today and I'll see you next time.